What's up? What's good? What's poppin'? What's crackin'? What's What's really good? In the hoodish man, Theo Butler. I'm back. It's another video. I'm gonna try and keep it light, even though it's dealing with a serious subject. Try and keep this keep this thing positive and everything. <clears throat> this video is about Deshaun Watson. Y'all know last y'all know last week I did a video about Deshaun Watson. Like, good lord, Jesus have mercy a lot. Uh, the thing is, is that it's easier to make fun of Deshaun Watson ridicule him make jokes about him and not make jokes or ridicule the women you better not that <laughs> boy you better not say nothing about the women um and as you shouldn't because sexual assault is a very serious thing but i'm going to talk about something that we're not looking at the media isn't highlighting it I watched Skip and Shannon. I haven't heard them say anything. I could have missed it. I watched First Take. I haven't heard anybody from sports talk shows mention this. Deshaun Watson just asked for a trade. Now, let me play this out for you. Because some of you, are, you know, like I said, I don't. Excuse me. Had some on my camera. I'm just going to point some things out. As much as I go back to my Deshaun Watson video when I was cracking on him, roasting him and everything, I pointed out quite a few things. So don't come on my don't come on this video saying, Theo, why are you doing this? Well, ah, 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 ah. If you want to see me roast a dude, go back to the videos. If you need me to put the link, I put the link. I roasted him. But I am able to put things into perspective. Deshaun Watson just asked for a trade. <laughs> we didn't know any of this prior till then. And when one person came forth, another one, another one, another one, another one, another one. Now, nothing in life is 100%. That's a rare number. A hundred. Theo, what do you mean? I'm a father. Four doors. I'm whooping somebody's ass. The same way I felt about the R. Kelly situation. I whooped R. Kelly's ass a long time ago is what I'm telling you. I would have whooped his ass a long time ago. I'm telling you, I would have whooped his ass a long time ago. He's not doing time right now because I have whooped his ass so bad. He didn't got the help he needed. He's still dropping songs. Even though I kind of believe he still he just dropped another song. Yeah, I ain't, I, I ain't saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. Nevertheless, so I have four daughters, and I just said I'm whooping somebody's ass if not doing something else worse. I would like to think that if something happened to four of my daughters, one of them would be able to say something to me and I, as dad, going to make it do what it do. We got 21 women. Twenty one women and they all just not coming forward. Twenty one women. They all just coming forward. You know how unlikely that is. We're just now hearing about it, even though these crimes took place in the past. We're just hearing about it. Do you know how unlikely that is? 21 women. We just not hearing basically from all 21 of them. Do you know how unlikely that is? 
See, notice what I'm doing. I'm not saying it didn't happen. I'm asking to think about the likelihood that they just, all of them, just coming forward. This news is just coming to light. This has been going on for two years. Two. Deshaun Watson has signed a whole new contract. ESPN to put a story on there about the boy getting baptized and everything. Where was this at when he What make more sense? I ask this question. What make more sense? Doing this when he just signed that new contract? Or doing this when he's trying to leave Houston? Deshaun Watson is being tried in the court of public opinion. None of the 32 owners in the league look like him. His reputation is irreparably damaged. It is. Regardless of how this plays out, if he's exonerated, somebody's going to always look at him with a side eye and they're going to say the only reason why he got away with it because he got money. Got baptized, signed a contract, nothing. You fall out with your football team, the Houston Texans, because they said they were going to consult with you in regards to coaching, who they hired for as coaching. They didn't do that. You demand to leave. You say you want to be traded. You know, if you look at the dates he was doing some of this last year. During COVID. You know, Deshaun Watson played the whole football season. You hear anything during the football season? I didn't either. I'm not saying it's right. Give me a minute. Do not knock on that door again. Kids. Sir? Kids. I'm in my house. It is what it is. <laughs> At the end of the day, though. Before any of us rush to judgment, let's keep an open mind. Understand that if you can roast Deshaun Watson, understand why you can't roast Deshaun Watson and not anyone else. I ain't saying, I'm just saying. Peace.